So I'm done here at Laipaha, Laipaha, or whatever, however you pronounce it. I ended up staying at a hostel yesterday. It was actually pretty good, actually. Um, there wasn't many people there, but I had the whole dorm room to myself, so I got to rest and relax. Um, so just rolling around uh, the wharf, around uh, the pier in uh, Laipaha, and uh, see a lot of uh, old old boats and uh, old naval uh, naval uh, ships around and uh, still filled with a lot of dilapidated uh, buildings around actually and even in the center and stuff on the western part of uh, the city it's got a park and it's a really uh, lovely park um, it's uh, you know it's got sh a lot of shaded areas uh, nice cut lawns um, manicured uh, gardens filled with different types of plants and flowers just never obeying the rules am i i'm actually pretty impressed with the, the beach here actually it's wide the sand's nice there's a lot of uh, uh, bars and uh, restaurants along uh, the beach. It's really, really nice. It's prime condition right now for kite surfing. Oh, every time I'm at the beach and it's windy, I'm always thinking of kite surfing. God damn it. It's kind of nice how it's got a play equipment uh, for the children on the beach. You don't really see too much of that, and I think. Um, yeah, it's kind of a nice touch. I am liking this place a lot. Even though I'm not spending too much time here. Uh, hopefully I'll be back. Beautiful place. Actually, that's one thing I haven't seen much at all around uh, Latvia and Estonia. Uh, market stalls. That might be because I haven't spent a great deal of time in a lot of the places that I've, uh, I've visited and um, yeah, I just haven't found them, but uh, I found this one. It's clothing market, food market, fruit and vegetables, and uh, mm, I love the smell of them. The fruit, the flower market. Oh, it's nice. I like seeing a bit of liveliness in the city. Alrighty then, so I think uh, I'm going to leave it there and uh, start heading uh, south and out of uh, this uh, lovely, lovely place. I've got a host for the next couple of days, so uh, yes, got a bed, <laughs> nice. It's not that I don't like camping, I love camping, but it's annoying having to set up every single time. You know, at the start I was like, oh yeah, I don't mind going to these dirt roads. You know, a bit of an adventure. Now it's like... Now it's like, I just want to get the hell off them. They're slow. They're dusty. Oh man, they're bumpy. And it's just really uncomfortable. As soon as I hit the dirt roads, I was like... <laughs> it's just not... It's just not cricket. Ah! Finally! Finally! I'm uh, back on the highway. Oh my god. Oh. That... Is a beautiful feeling. Oh, oh I'm so happy. Oh, man, that just puts a massive smile to my face and my motivation again just goes back up. So, time has come to an end for Latvia. There we go. There's the Latvia. Latvian flag. Bye bye Latvia. 
the end of uh, the Latvian adventure and uh, a new era starts in Lithuania.